Despite countless years of research into our solar system and the universe as a whole, the vast scale we're dealing with ensures there will always be more to discover. Usually, it's just more stars, a few meteors, or planets with a delicate balance. The universe requires anomalies, but they are rare. However, the James Webb Telescope recently detected a massive ancient force beyond the observable universe, surprising everyone. This force holds more cultural significance than scientific, inspiring an entire generation. Let's delve deeper into what this ancient force is and how it's reshaping the world of science. The Babylonians began studying space around 1000 BC, marking the beginning of humanity's fascination with the cosmos. Over millennia, our understanding of space has evolved alongside technological advancements. Instruments like the telescope, pioneered by astronomers such as Galileo Galilei, transformed our ability to observe celestial phenomena. Galileo's discoveries challenged prevailing theories and paved the way for future explorations. Fast forward to today and we have instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, which has pushed the boundaries of space exploration. Its recent discovery of ancient energy at the universe's edge is groundbreaking. This energy, dating back to the universe's infancy, offers insights into cosmic evolution. Beyond astrophysics, it holds potential for revolutionizing renewable energy. Scientists are diligently studying its properties and behavior, aiming to harness its power for clean and sustainable energy solutions. Unlike traditional fossil fuels, which contribute to climate change, this ancient energy source offers a carbon-neutral or even carbon-negative alternative. By tapping into it, we could reduce reliance on harmful energy sources, mitigate pollution, and combat climate change. The potential applications of this energy extend far beyond astrophysics, offering hope for a sustainable future. Harnessing this ancient energy source elevates our goals of transitioning to a low-carbon energy system. Governments, organizations, and individuals worldwide recognize the urgency of combating climate change. This energy source presents a significant opportunity to accelerate this transition while ensuring a sustainable future for generations to come. Beyond its environmental impact, as an ancient energy source persisting for billions of years, it offers the potential for long-term energy generation. Unlike finite fossil fuel reserves, which are depleting over time, if effectively harnessed, this energy source could provide a virtually limitless and powerful supply of clean energy. However, to fully leverage its clean and sustainable potential, extensive research and development efforts are needed. Scientists must understand its characteristics, behaviors, and energy conversion mechanisms to design and optimize technologies capable of harnessing and utilizing this energy. Efforts are already underway to explore various techniques for energy extraction, conversion, and storage that can make this ancient energy source viable for practical applications. The data collected by the James Webb Telescope provides a valuable foundation for further analysis and exploration. Moreover, the discovery of this ancient energy also alters our understanding of the universe. It offers a glimpse into the early stages of cosmic evolution, allowing scientists to observe the fundamental processes shaping galaxies, stars, and other celestial objects. The JWST has made significant progress in this area by uncovering six entirely new galaxies that challenge prevailing cosmological theories. According to current models, galaxies in the early universe should be relatively small and grow larger over billions of years. However, the discovery of these massive ancient galaxies contradicts these expectations, raising questions about existing theories. This model, based on general relativity and incorporating concepts such as dark matter and dark energy, forms the basis of our understanding of the universe's evolution since the Big Bang. However, the existence of massive ancient galaxies at such an early cosmic age introduces complexities that may require revisions to our current cosmological theories. Researchers need to delve into galaxy studies with much greater detail than before. In response, scientists have adopted new approaches, including unveiling a stunning 3D visualization of nearly 5,000 galaxies studied by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. Telescopes, including the JWST, function as time machines of sorts, enabling scientists to study light that has traveled across vast distances through space. 
This capability allows us to look back in time and witness the universe as it appeared in the distant past. The JWST, with its advanced capabilities, can detect both visible light and infrared waves. While visible light observation provides information about the present state of celestial objects, its true power lies in analyzing infrared waves. Infrared radiation, with longer wavelengths than visible light, can penetrate through dense regions of dust and gas in space without being scattered or absorbed. This allows the JWST to peer through cosmic dust clouds, revealing ancient stars and galaxies that emit heat energy as infrared radiation. By utilizing its infrared capabilities, the JWST can study light emitted over 13 billion years ago by the most ancient objects in the universe, providing a snapshot of the early universe's evolution. Studying the infrared data collected by the JWST enables scientists to learn more about the composition, dynamics, and characteristics of these ancient celestial entities, contributing to our understanding of the universe's history. It's like taking a virtual flight through space spanning billions of light years, bringing us closer to truths hidden in plain sight. Galaxies, including spiral galaxies like our Milky Way, are vast systems of stars, gas, and dust held together by gravity. Understanding their structure, especially the spiral arms, is crucial for unraveling the processes shaping their formation, evolution, and dynamics. However, studying the spiral structure of galaxies presents challenges, especially with distant galaxies where dust obscures visibility. In these cases, the JWST's infrared vision is invaluable. Its infrared sensors can detect and capture infrared radiation that penetrates through cosmic dust more effectively than visible light. This enhanced resolution allows scientists to trace and map out intricate galaxy structures, identify patterns, and measure various parameters contributing to a deeper understanding of galactic formation and evolution. By studying galaxy structures at different distances and ages, Scientists can explore how spiral arms evolve over time and investigate factors influencing their formation and persistence, such as gravitational interactions, density waves, and star formation activities. The James Webb Space Telescope has significantly contributed to the study of star-forming regions. Using its near-infrared camera and mid-infrared instruments, these observations have provided unparalleled insights into the processes of stellar birth and the intricate mechanisms at work within these regions. Star-forming regions, often termed cosmic nurseries, are where new stars emerge from dense clouds of gas and dust. They are characterized by intense radiation, powerful stellar winds, and energetic interactions between forming stars and their surroundings. The instruments aboard the JWST are specifically designed to observe celestial objects in the near-infrared and mid-infrared wavelengths, making them ideal for studying star-forming regions. Observations of star-forming regions, such as the pillars of creation within the Eagle Nebula, have yielded unprecedented views of the early stages of stellar birth. These observations allow scientists to study the intricate structures within the pillars, identify protostars and young stellar objects, and investigate the physical conditions, chemical compositions, and dynamics of the surrounding materials. Studying star-forming regions in such detail provides insights into the mechanisms driving star formation, the interplay between gravity and radiation, the impact of stellar feedback on the surrounding environment, and the evolution of protoplanetary disks that give rise to planetary systems. This knowledge is crucial for understanding the birth and evolution of stars, the formation of planetary systems, and our broader existence in the cosmos. Additionally, the JWST aids in the study of dark matter, a form of matter that doesn't interact with light or other electromagnetic radiation but is inferred through its gravitational effects on visible matter and the large-scale structure of the universe. By observing celestial objects and structures influenced by the gravitational effects of dark matter, the JWST maps out its distribution on different scales, including galaxy clusters, gravitational lensing effects, and the large-scale structure of the universe. These observations help scientists understand how dark matter clusters and interacts with visible matter, shaping the distribution of galaxies and influencing their dynamics. Furthermore, the JWST observations contribute to investigating the behavior of dark matter on both small and large scales, providing valuable clues about its role in the evolution of cosmic structures. 
While the JWST's primary mission focuses on infrared astronomy and studying early cosmic structures, its observations inadvertently contribute to the collective knowledge and data used by scientists studying dark matter. In addition to its contributions to dark matter research, the JWST has been instrumental in studying galaxy formation. Galaxy formation is a complex process involving the collapse and subsequent evolution of primordial matter within the framework of gravitational interactions. Through its observations, the JWST has captured light emitted by ancient galaxies, allowing scientists to study them as they appeared billions of years ago, further enhancing our understanding of cosmic evolution. These observations provide a window into the early stages of galaxy formation, offering a glimpse of the conditions prevailing during those formative years. By analyzing the properties of these ancient galaxies, such as their structure, composition, and dynamics, scientists can derive valuable insights into the mechanisms driving galaxy formation. The JWST observations have challenged existing models and theories by uncovering unique characteristics and phenomena that were totally unexpected. The discovery of massive ancient galaxies by the JWST has defied expectations set by current models of galaxy formation. These galaxies, far larger than presumed possible for their early cosmic epoch, have raised intriguing questions about the processes that led to their formation and growth. By studying their environments, astronomers can refine and develop new theoretical frameworks to better explain these observations, as existing knowledge falls short in this regard. Since the James Webb Space Telescope has a remarkable capability to observe the far infrared part of the electromagnetic spectrum, it can even capture light from the early universe that has been redshifted, allowing for the study of objects and phenomena that took place during the early stages of the universe's expansion. Redshifting is a phenomenon caused by the expansion of the universe, resulting in an increase in the observed wavelength of light emitted by objects moving away from an observer. The ability of the JWST to detect and observe redshifted light from the early universe is of extreme importance to astronomers and cosmologists. It enables the exploration of the characteristics, properties, and behavior of objects and phenomena that existed in the early stages of the universe's expansion, often referred to as the cosmic dawn. This redshifted light also allows for the investigation of cosmic microwave background radiation, which is the relic radiation from the early universe, providing insights into fundamental questions about the origin of the universe, the nature of dark matter and dark energy, and the mechanisms driving cosmic expansion. Additionally, the observations of redshifted light contribute to our understanding of the large-scale structure of the universe. By studying the distribution and clustering of galaxies at different redshifts, astronomers can trace the cosmic web and investigate the growth of cosmic structures over billions of years. The James Webb Space Telescope has also played a significant role in advancing our understanding of black holes, particularly in relation to the discovery of the most distant active supermassive black hole to date in the galaxy known as C-19. Detected by the JWST, this extraordinary black hole was born 570 million years after the Big Bang, making it one of the earliest known active supermassive black holes in the universe. Despite being less massive compared to other black holes identified in the early universe, it remains extremely powerful. These findings challenge existing knowledge and theories regarding the growth and formation of supermassive black holes, shedding light on their crucial role in shaping galaxy evolution in the early universe. The presence of a less massive black hole at such an early cosmic age raises questions about the mechanisms that enabled its formation and rapid growth within a relatively short period. This groundbreaking discovery not only expands our understanding of black hole formation, but also provides valuable insights into the conditions and processes that occurred during the early stages of the universe's history. The James Webb Space Telescope has also been instrumental in discovering the oldest known black hole in the universe. What sets this finding apart is the black hole's remarkable mass, estimated to be 10 million times that of the sun. This ancient black hole raises intriguing questions about the mechanisms that allowed such massive black holes to emerge and evolve so rapidly within a relatively short cosmic time frame. 